I love the variety of activities that we're allowed to get involved in. We do a lot of sick training and uh, a lot of running. Tuition is really extremely good. All the tutors have been hired specifically for the area that they're teaching. They've all got a uh, previous knowledge. They'll listen to everything that you want to do. Excellent facilities, got a great sports hall. It's a lot of fun and you make a lot of new friends. It's just the, the course to be on. The ethos here at Nelson Con College on the Uniform Public Service course is all about standards. It's about positive mental attitude. We all know right and wrong and they have to live that when they do this course. You cannot go to be a police officer in two or three years time and decide you're not going to book someone, you're not going to do your job. So we have to be positive and have a very positive mental attitude. Everything we do is to promote them and themselves in the confidence, some of the team building activities we do. You know, a lot of the physical, we do a great deal of physical because that is one of the biggest obstacles today because there's not as much physical training today in the schools and that comes through to us in the end. So we have to do a great deal of physical activity. The range of lessons we do um, is massive. Uh, we do a lot of practical and also theory-based lessons. Like just on a Tuesday's afternoon, we're going to go practice putting up tents when we do our two-day expedition. We we'll also do a classroom base when we're looking at transferable skills that which come from leadership. Uh, skills learning about the different types of leadership styles and um, also on the course we have uh, a lot of guest speakers who come in. We've had the prison service, police, road traffic police, um, we've had RAF come in. I think it's an amazing course and out of the other colleges in the area I'd definitely say come to Nelson Con to do it. The physical side of the course it's really important because it's not only helping you get into the future you want to do but it's also training you up to be somebody stronger and you show a different side of who you are. Obviously you're showing commitment within uh, physical exercise. It is extremely important if you want to take this into your career, maybe an armed force or just a uniformed force. It does pay off to uh, where you want to go in life. We're really lucky with the Richmond opportunities on this course. There's a lot to get involved in. Like today, for instance, we've organised this Help for Heroes charity event, which consists of travelling 3,557 miles, which is equal to the distance from college to Camp Bastion. It's averaging at 40 miles per person, and we're all getting stuck in, working together as a team. The weather's turned out all right for us, so hopefully we'll get it done. We pick up a lot of life skills on the public services course. They take us outdoors a lot. We climbed the mountain last week, Hell Valley. We went to the Striding Edge, which is very high. And I have, I have a fear of heights, which I conquered. We do a lot of map reading skills, which helps us work as a team and find our way. And that really helps us along in life, and we could use it in future. The uh, career prospects are very wide and broad. Um, we find a lot of students go to university to study public services and other public service related subjects. They also can do things like law criminology, police-based subjects. We get a lot of students that also go directly into the public services, aged 18, um, into the military, and beyond that, 2021, to the police, the fire service, paramedics. It's made me a better person. I've changed physically and mentally. I've learned lots of different new skills. I think it's given me a massive boost in confidence. It's opened different doors. It's improved my fitness and I've made new friends and it's given me a lot of experience in life. I want to go in the RAF. It's been brilliant. I really don't want to leave. <laughs>